It's Lee Ryan from Blue. What's in the box? I bet it's some leftover merch from his garage. Hello, celebrity dating agency. Hello, it's Lee. Oh, oh in you come, Mr. Ryan. <laughs> Gifts. Oh, what are you wheeled? I bought, I bought you guys something that I thought you'd love. Oh my, what a tremendous surprise. I did not expect to see Lee's package this morning. And it's so big. Oh, Look at that. that. So... Has he dropped it? Do you know something about cheesecake? Go on, tell me. It's not American at all. No. It's ancient Greek. Ancient Greek? Call cool, that's got to be out of date, innit? Wallop, yes please. Thank you. On fire. Is it In really? about something like 800 BC, they served it to the first Olympians. That's amazing. What about hot dogs? <laughs> <laughs> what about hot dogs? Uh, what's going on? I shall call my superiors. Yeah, OK, cool. And see if they're ready to probe you. <laughs> oh, God. Yeah, he can't help himself, <laughs> Leroy from Blue. You'll get used to it. Hi, darling. Have you got a yummy Lee there? <laughs> All right, Anna, keep it profesh. Send him up, please, Tom. Yes, please. Bye. Farewell. I see you soon. Lee! Lee Ryan! Look at the leaning. Look at the leaning. From Blue. Hey. The leaning. You good? Yeah, man. After having a shocker at the mixer, Lee Ryan from Blue's dating finally got up and running when he went on his first ever agency date with Daisy. So I can wiggle my eyes? No? Is this awkward? <laughs> it's a little bit awkward. Mm, I'll say a ton awkward. How did it go with Daisy? <laughs> oh, God. Um, did you show her anything interesting about you? I did. I, I, side? I wiggled my eyes. Pardon? I can wiggle my eyes. Can you do it oh, now? Oh, God, I've got to try and do it now. Hold on. Right, watch. Oh, my God. Oh, I can see that. Oh, yeah, I can see it, yeah. <laughs> 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 I mean, the question is, how did Daisy react with this extraordinary talent? Ejaculated immediately. She was very... Did, yeah. did like you... this, so I'm just very... I'm a very animated person. I'm very this. I use my hands mm -hmm. to talk. Very expressive. Yeah. So, obviously, for her, for I her. probably looked like she was having dinner with, dinner with an octopus. Doubt it, an octopus would have spoken more sense. Did you fancy Daisy? For me, there was something missing. Yeah. I do like girls with a bit of... Personality a bit bubbly, something of you know. And did you not it, feel? No, no, she was really? very yeah. internal. Internal? Is that even a thing? Or is that the band from the nineties? It is okay to not fancy all your dates. I actually, I want to see what I'm. I want to see what else is going on. You're telling us you'd like to try some more dates. Yeah. Meet your next date, Sarah. Okay. Very nice. From the first off, I don't really fancy her. Are we looking at the same girl? Never judge a book by its cover, but it might be interesting for you to learn that she's travelled Australia, she lived a very boho lifestyle in a camper van. OK. I can see us having a lot to talk about, cos I'm sure she's experienced a lot on them travels. He'll be trying to get her down under in seconds. You mentioned that when you were talking to Daisy, mm. that she sat like this. Yeah. You did this. Yeah. Mm. I want... This is me, right? Well, no, I just... I'm not aware of myself being... Well, I'm very expressive with very my hands. Expressive. I talk with my hands, yeah. Yes. We're asking you to just be a little bit more self-aware, be mindful, yeah, yeah. and enjoy trying that out. OK, I'll have a go. OK, good. Yeah. I ain't holding me breath. <laughs> All right, guys. All right. <laughs> Bye, Lee. Right, see you. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Take care. Bye, Dom. Was it... Sarah? I just said that, Leroy, I'm from Blue. I just... Oh, <laughs> Dating 101, remember the name. I better not do that tonight. Be like... So, um. So, Katie. Sarah. What? Oh, sorry. Banter. <laughs> All right, love. <laughs> that work. <laughs> no, it won't, Simon Webb from Blue. Hi, I'm Sarah. I'm 29, from Wakefield. I'm a freelance makeup artist with the best Yorkshire accent. My best feature, let's go with the bum. Do you like my earrings? Uh, let's go with the bum. You all right? I'm good, how are you? Yeah, nice I'm good, you. you too. You all right? Yeah, you. Yeah, I'm very well, thank you. Oh, thank God she didn't look down. I'm a little bit nervous. I bet you, I bet yeah. you are. Yeah, I mean, it's Lee Ryan from Blue, guys. I didn't 
fancy Sarah in the picture, but in person... You want to tweak her nipples? Where are you from? I'm from Wakefield. Do you know her? Near Leeds. Can you not tell? I've got a lovely northern accent. Not really. Leeds. <laughs> it's very leeds -y accent. Leeds. <laughs> oh, it gets worse. I've it got... No, worse. I used to have a, bit, a business partner that I used to work with, and he was from Leeds. Selling those glittery boots. So far, one sale. Lee Ryan from Blue. This is one of my favourite. That's a cheesy one, isn't it? it? It's got a little bit of cheese. I don't like cheese. You don't like cheese? Who don't like cheese? I love cheese. It's the smell you don't like of cheese. Yeah, but do you know, like creamy things like stroganoff? Beef stroganoff. Yeah. So my mum made a beef stroganoff once. Yeah. And uh, <laughs> it's really, it's God's honest truth. I just got in the band. I mean, most people celebrate with champagne, but I guess you're not most people, are you, Lee Ryan from Blue? There was this cat. In, that lived on the square we lived in. Yeah. And I found it dead with a mushroom in its mouth, right? And it had, et it had eaten my mum's beef stroganoff, right? And, and I, so they was really upset about it, their tomcat. Yeah. And I went in Smash It's magazine and I said, my mum's stroganoff killed the next door neighbour's cat. And I forgot, and she she knocked on my mum's door with a Smash It's and went, oh did, my you kill my, did you kill my cat? <laughs> Should have sent some to Westlife. That's my experience about beef stroganoff. I did a lot of work out in Italy. I actually did one of the voiceovers for, uh, you know, the Ice Age movies. Oh, I love Ice Age. Which one were you, Sid, Diego? I was one of the little possums. That's cool. Is it? But I don't speak Italian. <laughs> so I, I was in Ice Age two, three, four and five. Went downhill after one, if you ask me. I do it in Italian. So, so you're I'm... always a possum? Yeah, but in Italian. Who have they got doing the Spanish version? H from Steps. How do you get on with that? I've heard Trust your me. pronunciation. Yeah, it's awful. <laughs> I think that's the reason why it's good, because it's absolutely awful. That's what I think it is. God, give me a little bit of a like. I have to piece it together like. Oh, God. I don't know what I'm saying. I think you just ordered some Noki by mistake. I want to go to Iceland as well. Hmm? Have you been there? No. no. I want to go in the Blue Lagoon. Is that where Father Christmas is? <laughs> Babes, that's, that's Lapland. There goes his Finnish Ice Age voiceover gig. <laughs> Can I just get a check? <laughs> if you could invent anything, what would you invent? A pump that actually works. I mean, oh, I mean a t time machine or something. Time machine. Got a bit of time machine. Yeah, yeah, that. That's kind of cool. Mm -hmm. Would you go forward or back? I want to go back because when your grandparents tell you about the times that they had, they sound like the most amazing times. Yeah, world wars, food rationing. God, it would be great, wouldn't it? I want to go forward. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I want to go forward. Mm -hmm. Yeah, about half an hour to the goodnight kissy kissy kiss stage. Not scary. Yeah, it is scary. Mm -hmm. Imagine you turn up and it's like the Matrix and it's just yeah. mm -hmm. robots everywhere. <laughs> Do you know what I'd really love to see? Yeah. If we've made contact with aliens yet. You know what? That doesn't surprise me. Who um, built the pyramids? Aliens? Yeah, 100%. Yeah, yeah. Of course, aliens came down, made some triangles and left never to be seen again. I'd love to meet an alien. Carrying on wearing those boots for long enough, you will, Lee Ryan from Blue. I literally would. I'd be like, can you take me to another planet? I want to see what it's like. <laughs> you turn up and go, hey, <laughs> I'm from <laughs> that place called Earth. And they'd be like, oh, yeah, you could have at least sent Duncan James from Blue, couldn't you? I have seen an alien. No, you haven't. Oh. I've on my life. Listen, no, I promise you. Right. So tell on me my about life, it. I've seen an I alien. Want details. I was going through the Swiss Alps. So I went to the front of the bus. We was on tour. I was talking to the guy, and I said to him, "Do you see a lot of like aliens and stuff?" He said, "They're all up in the mountains." Well, they're not going to go skiing at the bottom, are they? No way. I was like, really? So we started having a chat about it. Literally about an hour, hour into the conversation. I swear on my life, I saw this red dot come out of the mountain, went into the middle, and then went phew, up in the end, gone. Probably took one look at your boots and fucked off back to the Milky Way. As far as. Was it a shooting star that. No, it was red? a red thing. It was like a dot. It wasn't a shooting star. It, was, it, went, it went like this really slow. Like, really fast. It, yeah, it went, it go. <laughs> and then it go. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah, now he's made the noises, I believe him. Aliens, pyramids. I'm starting to get deep with this girl. And we're having a right laugh. And actually, I, I feel myself opening up, which is good. So, Have you seen a ghost? Yeah, seen a ghost too, yeah. Of course he has. I was in rehab. <laughs> <laughs> He's not joking. Uh, What's the most awkward date you've ever been on? I once went on a date and, like, I kind of knew his dad. What? <laughs> really? Yeah. What do you mean, kind of knew his dad? Well, kind of, yeah. What, like, kissed his dad? Maybe. 
A little bit, only a little bit. We've all been there, but to be fair though, my wife's dad is a great kisser. Strong lips, pure heart. Thank you. Thank you very Thank much. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Where's my bloody card? Ah, oh, that old chestnut. Have you give it to her? Oh my god. I ain't lying. I think it's my card's. Card. It's in my jeans. Where's my jacket? It's there. Oh, it's in there. Oh, my. For a minute, I thought we had been abducted by aliens. <laughs> That's what I said to you. You don't give it to the lady. No, I was like, hold on a minute. It's not... Who's like? I thought I was blonde. Oh, no, I am proper blonde. Oh, I like that. So that Somebody's really dumber than me. I <laughs> <laughs> love that. <laughs> Should we go then? Yeah, let's go. Uh, uh. <laughs> Arrivederci. Those waiters are thinking, I know that voice from Ice Age 3. Thank you so much. Oh, I had such a nice time. Yeah, lovely time. I had an amazing date. Maybe if there is a second date, we can be a little bit more romantic. There you go. Thanks, babe. I would like to see her again on another date. She's very pretty, but I think she's got a lot more than that. I really like her. I'll uh, see you soon, ah, OK? Nice Take to care. meet you. And you. See you later. Oh, Lee Ryan from Blue, from dating reject to one love in just two dates. Who'd have thought it? Darling Ryan from Blue.